Hi guys, it's Philip with American Products. We're here today to do a product review on the American Sanders AVAC 26. With us today we have Kevin Brophy, also known as American Sanders Kevin. If you do not know, um, American Products is the premier hardwood flooring supplies in, uh, in the southeast. And uh, you know, now I'm going to turn it over to Kevin and let him uh, walk you through the AVAC 26. Alright, thanks Phil. Uh, so as Phil just said, I'm Kevin Brophy with American Sanders. Uh, I go by American Sanders Kevin on social media. Uh, and today we're going to talk a little bit about the American Sanders AVAC 26. So as you can see, um, this is one of our, this is our one of our biggest dust containment uh, systems that we offer. It's 26 gallons. That's where the 26 comes from in the name. Um, it comes with three 800 watt motors. This is a, this is a 110 volt machine. Okay, but it's got three 800 watt motors in it. Uh, so 26 gallons, three motors. It comes with two 25 foot length, two inch in diameter hoses. Uh, then there's also a couple different connectors that come with it. So we have a two inch to inch and a half reducer. We have a, a joiner, which is to join the two hoses together. So if you wanted one 50 foot long, two inch hose, you could do that by joining those two together. And then we have a 45 degree hose adapter here. And this actually attaches into here if you want to use it almost like a crevice spool as well. Um, the power cable that comes with it, the power cord, okay, is 50 feet long. So super long, uh, enough cable to, to plug in the vacuum anywhere throughout the job site. Um, the CFM on this, so a lot of people are going to say, you know, three motors, that's, that's a lot. It is, there's 255 CFM on this, and I believe the water lift, which I know some people are going to ask, is 72 inches of water lift, okay? Um, that being said, one of the other really cool things about this product is that all three motors are, are ran off of their own individual switches. So, for example, if I wanted to only run one of the three motors, I just flip on one motor. If I wanted to run two, I could just run two. And if I wanted to run all three, I could run all three. So the other really cool thing about this is um, obviously with the versatility of being able to run however motors, however many motors you want, um, you know, that might come in handy because it is being a, a three motor unit uh, this is rated for 20 amps, so you will have a, a plug-in on the end of it that is a 20 amp, 110 volt plug-in. That being said, if you only have a 15 amp plug-in in the house that you're working in or on the job site, you can only run two out of three motors and you're not going to be over that threshold of uh, 15 amps. So, very convenient. Uh, it comes with dust bags. Let me show you the dust bags real quick because this is one of the one of the reasons why we're doing this video is to show everybody how the dust bag works. So obviously you see there's just three very robust clamps that hold the lid down, which is a clear lid. So you can actually see inside uh, when your bag is full, it's very convenient. Then we have our cloth bag here, okay, which just drops in. And then we have our actual dust bag. Now these are the dust bags that come with it. Okay, this one's a little bit dirty because we, you know, we were using clean the floors and stuff. But as you can see, there's an elastic band, all right? And this goes around top of this, just like so. Put it on here, and it clips in just like that. That's our dust bag. That's where all the dust is going to come down uh, from, from the lid. So all the dust that comes into this is going to come through the top and go right down. Super ergonomic design because the motors are on the bottom of the unit, so it's pulling all the air and all the dust and, and all the dirt from the top all the way down, so it's allowing gravity to help with the dust collection process. Um, that being said, when you want to dump out the bag, you just lift this right out of the machine, take it outside, transfer it into a black contractor's bag, um, or however else you dispose of your dust. Um, in the bottom here, there actually is a false bottom so that the bag sits on top of the false bottom and doesn't get um, sucked in by the motors. That goes right back in. Put this down here. Let's put our lid on. And I'm going to show you
right here. So obviously you can see there's two ports here. There's a little stopper. So if you had your two hoses joined together and you only want to use one of these ports, you could put the rubber plug in one so you're only using one. If you want to use both hoses at the same time, you just pull that out and put one hose on each one of these collectors here. And you could run, say, two edgers at the same time, an edger or buffer at the same time. Um, if you want to use it with your big machine, you could plug one of these up and let it run off your, or, and let it, uh, your big machine run off your vacuum. You can do that as well. Um, there is a, a filter in the back here. So this is the air filter that all the air that's being pulled through the machine, it gets filtered out through the bottom and uh, through this, and then this is what's blowing air back into the room. So this is just a standard filter here. You can upgrade to a HEPA filter if you so desire. And then let me just pull this stuff off here and I will show the bottom of the machine. Right here, there, this is the inlet filter. So this is where all those motors suck all the air in from, from the bottom. So there is a, a small filter underneath here, which occasionally you want to just use these thumb turns, pull this off and blow that filter out. The other really nice thing about this vacuum is these super heavy duty non-marking wheels that are on here. Super easy to move around. Okay. It's got the nice handle in the front of the vacuum here. And obviously the handle on the back makes it very easy for transporting uh, and getting in and out of your truck or in and out of the job site. Um, that's pretty much it. Um, I don't know, Phil, is there anything else you want to talk about? Got your, um, your filter bags here. You want to explain how those come, how often they should be changing them? Awesome. That, yeah, so earlier I spoke about uh, the, the filter bag underneath here, which all the dust falls into. So, pull this top off. There you go. Hold that for a second. This bag here. So, uh, Phil brings up a really great point. You know, obviously this is going to collect a lot of dust and over time it's going to wear out and you'll see, uh, you'll know when it's time to, to change it because it'll start to fray or, you know, you might get some small holes or something like that. Uh, luckily for contractors, when they do reorder bags, um, they come in a three pack just like this. The part number is TMB22563 and uh, that's how it comes directly from, from us, the manufacturer. In this bag, as you can see, there's three of them in here. Um, one, two, and three, and they have the elastic. Uh, the other thing you want to note with these bags, I know there are some people out there that are using like garbage bags or, or solid bags. You can see this because you're real close, but there's like very tiny perforations in here that allow for air to pass through. And when you use, uh, say, like a, a plastic bag or a contractor bag or something as a dust collection bag in here, it actually will inhibit uh, the machine and, and how it works, uh, specifically how much suction you have. It's not going to allow for very much suction, and it's also going to be uh, pretty detrimental to the motors. It'll really expedite how long those motors are going to last. Uh, it's going to burn them out really quickly. So uh, make sure you order these bags. I know Ampro has them in stock, uh, which is really great. Um, but yeah, again, that part number is TMB225163. And again, it's a three pack. Um, I would recommend, you know, every contractor just kind of order, order a three pack and just keep it on your truck and you can replace them as needed. So uh, what's the weight on this unit altogether? Oh, so that's another another great question. So this is a, it's a pretty stout unit, uh, but altogether it's 121 pounds, and that's with you know with everything in it. That's with the hoses and, and stuff. Yep. Yep. Okay. What's the warranty on this machine? A uh, standard one year warranty from the manufacturer. Obviously, um, if you're using a plastic bag in here, like we talked about, that's not going to be covered under warranty. Um, but everything else on it is covered for a full year. All right. So. Yeah. Well, I want to thank you guys for tuning in today, and I want to thank Kevin for coming in and yeah, sharing no this amazing product with us. Thanks for having me. Appreciate it. And again, American Products is your premier distributor for hardwood floors and accessories in the southeast. You can call any of our, you know, any of our branches and get uh, get any questions you have answered. And uh, hopefully, you enjoyed this video and it helped you out a little bit, and you learned a little bit about this product. And uh, thanks for tuning in.